Hi there, this is Scottish FM on my back here today with episode 3 of my Haze and Yedding save. Since the last episode, we have not lost 1, 3 and drawn 2. Uh, first law against Turu, uh, we won 3 1 with Josh Scott scoring twice and um, uh, 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 Ismail. Elu scoring once. Uh, they went up 1 0 and we managed to get three goals in the last 10 minutes, which was quite impressive. And in the next game against Chimford City, we managed to win 2 1. We went up 1 0, just, uh, just got scoring. Then they pulled one back, and I'm not even going to try and pronounce their player's name, but they pulled one back, and then we managed to score in the 87th minute to win 2 1. The next game against Maidstone, pretty disappointing considering we probably were the better team and we probably did deserve to win it. But as you can see, they've got they got a big massive crowd at home. Like they seem to be one of the bigger teams in the league for their crowd. Like so well, over two and a half thousand. Nobody else is even over one and a half thousand, so it's quite ridiculous. But two two draw was probably a fair result in the end. Uh, well, probably not. We probably did deserve to win, but. Not too com bad considering we're not too not not gonna to complain too much considering we're away from home. It could have been a lot worse. Now the next game was against Basingstoke and we managed to win one 0 Islam Erul scoring uh, scoring in the fortieth minute. And we probably we probably maybe should have scored one or two more, but I'm not gonna complain. So so the only thing I'm quite a wee bit annoyed about is that that game was on Saturday and now this game that we're going to live come against Maidenhead is on the Monday. So only one day in between which is quite a bit, quite annoying but as you can see they're the favourites but there's nothing we can do about it, we've just got to get along with it. Squad fitness is really one of the problems I'm going to be having but there's nothing you can do. So as you can see after five games we are third, although other teams have all played six, but we've only played five. So, I was going to say I would have been against Havre, I haven't, I haven't in Waterlooville, but it's no. Um, everybody must be playing, so, right, anyway. Uh, I was trying to see something, but. Right. So, right, the lineup. We are gonna go with. Uh, I'm not too sure yet actually. I think it will be. Oh god, good, good. Too many unfit players. <laughs> I think we'll just a bit. We've not really got much strength and depth now. I did say I was gonna try and sign a couple of players, but I just can't. I've got twenty pound left in the wage budget and. I don't really think the club's going to be bringing in a lot of money because we're not getting a big crowd. We've got the lowest crowd in the league and we've got a lot of debt. It's just going to be a hard challenge, us, but I'm up for it and we've just got to go on with it. And that's going to be the team for this game. I'm going to start with Lincoln and goals, Ferrell right back, Mambo and McCain centre back, Fenlon left back, uh, Brandon Keelan right wing, Jack Dyer Nicholson. Midfield, Harry Gra Grant on the left, Ismam Ull in attacking mid, and Elliot Benyon as a defensive forward. So let's get into this game. Maidenhead are the favourites for it, and I don't think we'll win this, but we've just got to try. Starting off the game and counting, I'm just going to see what happens. A lot of the Last couple of games I've been changing to attacking late on, and it seemed to be doing not too bad. Apart from maybe in the game we drew two all, but I think I just left the subs too too late. Please do not get sent off here. I'm oh, sorry, I thought he was going to get sent off. That'd have been the last thing I needed. Nicholson, my brilliant ball to Grant. Come on, oh Nicholson, Kiernan, Benyon. Yes, we're up one nil. Two minutes in. Best couldn't get a better start. Unless it's going on another goal. <laughs> that would just be 
put the icing in the cake. And hopefully, if that's how it will end up, have a load, which it doesn't look like doing. Well, that's it. Nicholson, my brilliant passer, with his brilliant vision. Kiernan, what a ball in. And he couldn't really miss from there. Uh, I seem to I seem to be uh, these players seem to have better vision than the Muller save uh, with Tottenham. Uh, I can't I mean, I'm just really struggling I've got like goats saying that and managed to get goats in a free transfer and that but they just they just don't have any vision or anything. That's a brilliant ball there. What a good defender I suppose. Read one. Come on, tackle him. Jenkinson, tackle, tackle him. Don't let him cross it. And, oh, I suppose. Thank God. Good clearing. I wonder if that's Wilshire's brother there. Yeah. Sorry, I wonder if that's Jack Wilshire's brother. Right, so, at the moment we're top of the league. Hopefully. I'd settle for a 1 0. I would settle for a 1 0. Yeah, just nearly half time. I'm going to have to time 1 0, and that'll do. I'm probably going to need to make some subs at some point. I'm just not really sure who to bring on. I didn't actually check my subs before the game. Uh, I'm just going to need to rotate with other players that aren't very fit. But we'll keep going the and hopefully. But the 6th, 8th minute we'll bring some subs on. Hopefully we'll still be winning by then. Oh, come on, Keelan. Brought ball through. Oh, I thought Benyon was going to score again there. It was disappointing. Had a chance, but couldn't take it. Oh, that's rubbish. Oh, right, I think. I don't even want to watch this. Uh, we're going to need to make a sub soon, I think. Oh, El Binion. Oh, go and die, I should have won that there. But Charles, go and check. Don't go and tackle him. Ah, oh, that's good. Yeah, come on, Nicholson, Grant. Oh, Benyon! Yes! That's poor defending there, but Elliot Benyon snap, snapped it up. Brilliant, brilliant ball there. Well, not really a good ball, but it's poor defend, poor chest back. Benyon, brilliant. Took his time and put it in the back of the net. Right, I'm going to make some subs now. I'm going to bring on Luke Williams for Jack Dyer, as Jack Dyer is more tired. I'm going to bring on Josh, no I'm not going to bring on Josh Scott, I'm just going to leave him. Uh, what am I going to do? I'm not really getting any other subs I can do except for the centre back. I'm going to bring on Ed Sanders for Mambo. That's going to do for me now. I'm not really sure what I can do. I should have had Connor Taylor on the bench because he can play on both wings, but doesn't really matter. Uh, I'm going to make another sub now, and it is just to play like injured Kieran, and I'm going to bring him off and bring on Wasfold. So hopefully, hopefully we can see this game out. Uh, I don't think that happened in this game, uh, but. Right, so oh, I meant to go into defensive there. I'm gonna go onto defensive now so I can waste time. Hopefully, we should see this game out. Can we get another late goal? Nicholson, Binion. Oh, I remember I should have got a side trick there, but it was going be good defending actually. Didn't realize we've got a corner. I thought it was just a bad shot. Hopefully, that's about a good cross in. Come on. Right ball in. Oh, I'm well, unlucky there. Number four, I'm not sure who number four is, but he's a chance there, but he's unlucky to miss. Let's put it back out from Browns. That's the game just a bit over. Swings it in. Oh, good defending. Again. Farrell. McCain. Grant. McCain. Grant. McCain out to Fenlon, Grant, Nicholson, Williams, Walsfold, swings it in Benyon, oh yes, yes we've won, 2-1 victory.
brilliant result. I actually thought we might have got better here, but technically we're away from home, but we're actually at home because this is the stadium we play in. I'm not, I'm still not too sure about the uh, stadium situation, but I did find out that I was right. It is London, uh, Hayes and Yeddings from Greater Run, Greater Young, Great, Greater London. But that's a brilliant result against Maidenhead. I'm, I'm, I'm just, I just thought they might have won that game, but obviously not. But uh, anyway, for the next episode, I'm tempted to do gospel. Oh, in fact, I'm tempted to actually do the FA Cup. It will either be gospel or the FA Cup, just depending who we get in the FA Cup. So, that's going to be it for this episode. I'm the Scottish FMA, and I'm out. See you next time. Bye.